Okay, this is the entrance to the theater. We'll be opening on Friday, July 22nd. Um, we're working hard to get things done. It's a little dusty. So a lot of training going on. So uh, this is the, I guess, the sneak peek behind the scenes as we prepare for opening this Friday. Uh, you have uh, five terminals to serve yourself. And if you notice that there's screens that are um, facing the customer, that's because we have three reserved seating houses and uh, the patron can then buy their ticket and then select the seat that they want to sit in for those three auditoriums. We also have D-Box motion code in one auditorium with 36 seats. Um, we have a demonstrator over here if people like to try it before, but basically it adds a, a fourth dimension to the movie. So instead of just 3D or 2D, you now have motion. So if you're in a helicopter flying on the screen, the seat will move with that helicopter movement. It's, wow. it's pretty cool and uh, we're getting a really great response. We have a concierge desk for if you have any issues. You don't have to go back down to the box office. We take care of you right up here. And then we have the full bar, beer, wine, uh, and any type of mixed drinks you would like. Um, we'll have full service. We have a, a chef-inspired menu that um, our executive chef from our Cine Bistro side of our business um, okay. has built. And then we have more seating off to here that will be um, both full serve and then self serve back there. So if you if you purchase something from the snack bar or you just wanted to get something a la carte and sit down before your movie, you could do that too. This is what we're calling the cafe. It's not a traditional cafe as you say, but it'll have uh, self serve yogurt, you know, um, so you sell it by the ounce with fruit, fresh fruit toppings, whatnot. We'll have, in the case, we'll have uh, some Pellegrino, some pita with uh, uh, hummus, uh, salads. We will have um, croissants. That's, that's a break from the traditional movie theater. Those are a healthier option than our... The entire theater is a break from the traditional theater. It's a little mix of, of our Cine Bistro, which is in, in theater dining, and a traditional theater. We've, we've kind of tried to bring the two together um, to make it a, a unique um, experience. You will also notice that the snack bar is not what you would see in a traditional snack bar. What we are doing here is we've created a pass-through so you can grab your popcorn and your drink if you'd like but as you walk through you can grab whatever you want and move along so you don't have to stand in that line that big line that you always see in the theater you can bypass all of it because all you wanted was your Twizzlers and you want to get out of here and you can do that too you just walk through grab what you need and go Okay. after a tour through the kitchen area we decided to check out the VIP party room and explore some of the theater. Ready, Matt? Heather, how are you? Good. And like I said, we the way we build them with the little, we have a little bit higher riser um, height, and the seats are a little wider. This is about 270 seats. If we were putting a standard seat, we'd probably fit another 75 seats in here. Um, most of the theaters you go into, you know, they're a little tight. These are, these are nice too. Now, and you can sit in one of these and you'll see that the, even though it's not as wide as the ones in the reserves there. Yeah, they uh, look like Normally we would have a pretty big pre-opening advertising campaign. Yeah. And we've had to keep the date pretty tight because we didn't know. Um, we were, you know, waiting to make sure that the place was um, adequately, adequately complete, yeah. especially to the city and the county's, uh, you know, liking because you know, we don't want to open when it wasn't safe and there were some hurdles they had to overcome. So w even though, I mean, we could have said, you know, hopefully we'll make it, well, we didn't want to do that. So yeah. we waited until we knew we were going to open. So um, really it hasn't, that date hasn't been out there until today. So because of that, you know, it'll probably not as b be as large as maybe um, it could have been, yeah. but that's okay. Be we'll be here for a long time. Yeah. <laughs>